Hey, what's up guys? Demon Driver here. I want to show you guys today how I use paint pens to add to the livery of my handmade scratch build RC airliners like the Siam Air Transport 737-300 of the Siam Air Transport uh, Limited of Thailand. They fly out of Bangkok and I'm going to show you how I take these little paint pens and I basically can add the um, streams and the strings and the different little curls and curves to the forward nose section right in here of our Siam Air 737. And I'm going to use these paint pens and I'm going to show you exactly how I do that. It's not the easiest thing in the world but it's, um, it's much easier believe it or not than having the decal printed out and then you have to cut the decal and it's very intricate. This is easier. I'm going to show you how I do that in this video. Okay. Okay, what are we going to need for this hand painting with paint pens of streamers and these flower, these flower petals onto the um, fuselage of our Siam Air 737-300? Well, the first thing I do is I print out um, what I what I want to do. I print it out just like this, so I can actually look at it. I don't have to constantly bring up my phone or whatever. I just have the photo printed, so I can use it as a reference. Second thing you want, obviously, are uh, paint pens. These are paint pens. You can buy them at any art store. Uh, Sharpie makes them. This is a brand by, uh, uh, I guess, just painters. Um, then we have the two colors that we're going to use, this dark purple and uh, this lighter pink. I don't know color names and I don't care. To me it's dark purple. I don't get in like fuchsia and all these crazy names. I don't care. So we got light light purple there. We got dark purple here. This is Sharpie. This is a, um, a paint pen. And these come in really handy. These are great for this kind of application. That's what we're going to do. So I'm going to stand those up because the ink flows down into the head felt tip of the pen. Then what we need are French curves, various French curves and different stencils. Um, when using by hand, these come in really handy. Um, a pencil, because we're going to first draw the line in uh, via pencil, then we're going to go over it with the, um, with the paint pen. Okay? Alright, let's enough talk. Let's get rocking. Alright, let me get you guys a front row seat here to the action. Um, you're going to have to just deal with the sun and the shade. I like working out in the sun. It, uh, I, can get, I can just see things a lot better in the sun than, you know, I, th I think that's true with everybody. Um, Alright, what do I, what do I want to do first? Well, I look at this picture that I printed out of the Siam Air uh, 737 300 nose section and what I need to do is I need to gently first thing I need to do is I need to remove this detachable nose section because we don't need that on the bird at the moment we don't need that on the bird right now okay because I'm gonna get southern on you here and, and you don't want that to happen because that's hey it's gonna get dangerous but let me just put that right there and just tape it to the fuse. A little bit of tape so it doesn't fly around. Okay. All right. What do I want to do first? See, I got to get an attack plan here. I got to get an idea of... So I get my French curves out. So the first thing that I see, that I notice here, is that the... Um, the dark purple line, the dark purple streamers, are over the, the lighter purple one. So that means the lighter purple line has to go down first. But before I do that, I take my pencil, and the streamers are all coming out of this whatever the hell that is. I don't know what that is, so whatever, an eyeball or some, it looks like an olive. It's a Thailand olive or something. It's a Thai olive, I don't know. I don't know what's going on with this. This is the part of doing your own um, liveries where you start to kind of lose your, lose your marbles. 
if you if you had any marbles to begin with. So I'm doing this first line here and it's coming off and it's gonna stream up and it's gonna kinda curl right around the, the M on the Siam. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come out with the pencil and gently, it doesn't have to be exact. So I got the thing and then what I'm gonna do is it's gonna come up here and it's gonna curve right, hang on, it's gonna curve right there, right there. And then it's gonna do a curvy thing about Bob right in here, like right around the M. It's gonna curve. So that's what I gotta draw. So alright. And then we got a, a weird branch off right here where it branches off from the branches off. There we go. And then it curves around like that. It curves around. All right, I don't know if you can barely, can you see it? You can actually see the line. All right, let's take our, first of all, first things first. I have a lot of these old um, granola bars. Like this is my snack, I don't eat junk food. I eat granola bars when, if I'm gonna eat a snack, I eat a granola bar, but the old boxes come in handy for like mixing up uh, epoxy or testing paint on, so. Look at that, that works real good. Okay. Let's go ahead. I'm gonna use the stencil to ride the line because that's, that's what it's there for. So here we go. Take the paint pen and ride the line. Here we go. Boom! Dry off the stencil, make sure you didn't get any paint there. Come around and do it again. Go back, Jack, do it again. Wheels turning around. All right, let's keep this rolling. So now I'm gonna come in here. Now this is where you gotta be careful that you don't contaminate the, um, the library. Because this is where you can really screw things up if you don't pay attention to what you're doing. All right, wait a minute. No, that's, that's, that's wrong. I'll come in and I'll use that. See, what I'm doing is I'm positioning myself and using different parts of the, of the French curve. These things are worth their weight in gold. They really are, guys. So I'm going to come around. No, that's not curved enough. Dad, now the damn thing's not curved enough. Where are you, son of a gun? Oh, don't want to. See, you don't want to, once the paint is on there, you don't want to bang something down onto it and ruin the paint. Okay, here we go. I'm going to make the curve right now. Oh, wait a minute. Can I get this through here? I can't. You mother. I'll have to use this back end here. See, unless you know what I'm doing, if you were, like, listening to my audio only, you wouldn't understand what the hell's going on. You're like, this guy, we're listening to audio of a crazy person. All right, here we go. All right. Now I'm going to freestyle. Ooh. Look at that. Yeah, baby. I'm liking that. All right, now we're going to do the branch off. We are now going to do the branch off. Here we are. Now I'm talking in my Paul Freeze voice. I'm just kidding. All right, here we go. All right. Here we go. Look at the branch off, see? Then I'm going to come around. You know what? I'm going to hand it. I'm going to hand freestyle. Oh, that looks good. Damn. Mm, mm, mm. My word. Okay, so... All right. 
So we got that down, right? We got that done. The lighter one is on there. Can you see that? Here, let me. That's what we just did. That's what I just hand drew. Right there. Darker purple. Now hopefully you can see, when I shade it out, hopefully you can still see it. All right, so the darker line is gonna come out and it's gonna wrap around like that. Come out and then go up. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna once again, it's gonna come out right there. It's gonna come out right here. There we go. Okay, I like that, I like it. I like it. I like it. Remember that irritating penguin from the 1960s, that penguin that used to talk like this? I think Don Adams did his voice. I think it was a sexually repressed penguin. There we go. All right, now I'm gonna come around. Come around. This is freestyling, baby. This is like, this is like the old French curves that pinstripers do on, on cars. Oh yeah, that's looking real good. And we're gonna come around with it and we're gonna go right there and we're gonna loop around Right there. They gotta strengthen up this part of the, of the curve. There we go, look at that. Play slightly, Mo. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well guys, that's what you can do with paint pens and a little bit of determination and some patience. And that's how paint pens can add to the library of your scratch belt RC airliner. They definitely come in handy. And guys, I appreciate your time. Thank you for joining me today and take care. Have a good weekend. Bye-bye.